All right, this is gonna be a setup video for Mage Light. This is just gonna be for the base game. So um, I'll, I think I'll do a different video going over the expansions and then a different video um, just walking through a little bit of, of how to play. So uh, in terms of setup, all you need for the base game is the 18 cards and then uh, some kind of token or coin, I use a penny. And uh, probably just in no particular order, I'll just start with whatever's on top here. Um, here's your four map cards, they're double-sided. Uh, the side with the asterisk is the core tile side, and then the countryside tiles uh, are on the other side. So give those a shuffle, um, put them in a stack with the core tile side up, and then draw from the bottom for your starting tile. And I'll just put those up there somewhere I can get at them when I need them. Uh, you'll take your penny or whatever you're using. Uh, it should be something that has two different sides because this is going to be your day-night tracker. So I'm going to put it on heads uh, to represent day. And I'm going to put it on this partial hex in the bottom left corner. That's where I'm going to start. And then you've got your eight action cards here. Um, Put them all to the starting half as a starting and a waning half. I'm just going to make sure that that's the case here. And then you also need to make sure they're on the basic side. So the, the advanced action side has the gold border. That one I think is flipped. Both of those are flipped. Okay, so then once that's all correct, go ahead and give them a shuffle. And then you can put them here as your D deck. These two cards are gonna track your reputation and your fame. So we're going to start us on zero fame. And all that means is we're gonna have the arrow on this card, point to zero. Um, you can see there's arrows on every orientation of the card. Uh, we're gonna start on the uh, yellow side, the gold side, if I can get it to focus for you. There we go. Uh, zero, it shares with plus two if you go around far enough. So as we gain reputation, we'd keep going around until we hit plus five, I think. Uh, so we'll start here at zero. Point that arrow to zero fame. What's next here? I think we'll just set out our enemy card so it's within reach somewhere. Sometimes I use it to cover up my, um, my map card deck so I can't see that top card. So you could do that if you wanted. We'll set these out. Um, this is your artifacts and spells, and these are your silver units and your gold units. We actually don't need these yet until we uh, gain an artifact or a spell uh, or a unit. These are actually going to go underneath our hero card when we gain them. And then you can set out your hero card. Start at... Uh, Come on, focus here. Start here with the first command token, the levels one, two. When we level up, um, we'll rotate it so that we're character level two, and then we gain that skill, and so on. And so put that out in front of you. Uh, then draw up your first hand. One, two, well actually, you have to draw it up from left to right, so I'll just set them out like that. Two, three, four, five. Uh, because the, the order that the cards are in will matter, and I'll go over that in um, a different video. But you draw your first hand, and that would be completed setup.